Settle down, folks. This is just a new form of matter, nothing else. Well, a new form of matter called time crystals. If you want to search it on Google, do it. Time crystals. Crystals usually are just, um, you know, something we think is a bling bling beautiful thing. But to Norman Yao, this, this researcher at Berkeley's, they are the tip of the iceberg. And actually, there are some people that believe that meditating or even having many crystals in your home, inside your home, will change the atomic structure of things around it. That's kind of crazy, right? But if you actually start to think about it, it isn't. The molecular structure of a crystal is perfectly spaced. You know, this, this folks, I cannot even start to understand or explain. But I can try, so this is, this is how I'm going to do it. So, you probably, you, you probably saw the structure of crystals, you know, in space, like we showed you right now. So what they discovered is how to do that in time. So make a crystal repeats itself in time. So what's going to happen is you're going to have a crystal that wobbles like a jello, non-stop, without the need of touching it. James, are you telling me that this crystal can teleport? Yeah, no, not that, but it looks like. And not only that, folks, you know, this is going to help them to develop new stuff around the quantum computer, quantum physics and whatnot. Going to, they're going to boost that probably with this new finding, the new form of matter, time crystals, right? So these, they, they are trying to zap lasers into these crystals with different magnetic fields and they take it out of equilibrium and they're calling it a non-equilibrium state of matter. For example, such as metals and, and isolators, they are equilibrium form of matter, right? And they are now exploring non-equilibrium matter, which would be time crystals, one of them, okay? So if you are as confused as I am, please do Google time crystals and try to understand it. It's quite complicated. We're gonna leave you with the 20 facts about crystals that like a lot of people don't know about. And if you are curious, about the, what I said in the beginning of the video about meditating around a crystal or having many crystals at home, please do Google that also. After studying a bit about crystals, you actually become more and more curious on why they exist as the way they do. So thank you very much for being here. Don't forget to subscribe, comment below, and I'll see you again. Settle down, folks. This is just a new form of matter, nothing else. Well, a new form of matter called time crystals. If you want to search it on Google, do it. Time crystals. Crystals usually are just, um, you know, something we think is a bling bling beautiful thing. But to Norman Yao, this, this researcher at Berkeley's, they are the tip of the iceberg. And 
Actually, there are some people that believe that meditating or even having many crystals in your home, inside your home, will 